Hello. 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 Hi. Hello. Welcome. Welcome to Monday Morsels in Bare Bones Kitchen. I am your culinary coach, Harmony. Cheers. All right, you guys. Seriously, I've been craving potatoes for like two days. And I swear I've already done something very similar to this, but I didn't find a video. So I had to go back to the videos and there wasn't one, so I'm doing it again. Or for the first time? I don't think it's for the first time though. All right, so I have some fingerling potatoes or some petite potatoes or whatever, little tiny potatoes, okay? I boiled them for about, I don't know, 15 minutes or so. They're just barely soft in the middle, you know, just barely soft in the middle. I'm gonna add a little bit of olive oil. And then I got like a super smoking deal on some fresh herbs, which I was super excited about because don't knock them discount areas, you guys. $1.29, $1.29 I have in here. This is the Roasted Herb Blend, and it is some Italian parsley, some rosemary, and some thyme. So, I chopped the shit out of that, right? And I put my potatoes in here, and I'm just going to sprinkle this right over the top. I mean, use your best judgment, you guys. Use your best judgment. I feel like these need some salt, though, so I'm going to get some salt. Actually, you know what? I'm just going to get my whole trifecta. I just, I didn't even take any of it out because I was like, oh, fresh herbs. Oh, right. Got to get my trifecta. I can't help it. My pepper, in case you don't know my trifecta. And I always like a fresh ground pepper. If you are partial to a already ground, you do you. I am not to judge. And my pink Himalayan sea salt, again, if you just have regular iodized salt, do whatever makes your heart and soul flutter. And then, of course, my Weber, my Weber stuff, my Weber roasted, roasted garlic and herb. I had to, I had to look at that. How sad is that? Because I always want to say it backwards, that's why. So I just have it in a bowl, and we're just going to flip it. And if you need to use a spoon, don't be ashamed. Use a damn spoon. Hello, Sue. Hello, Tiff. Hello, Sylvester. Cheers. I can't tell who else is up there. I see sunflowers, but I'm old and busted, so I can't see up there. I can't see who else is up there. I have my oven set to 375. And I have my pan that I roasted vegetables on last night. Look at that. Look at that. Ooh, nice clean bowl. Now I'm kind of weird. I like to have all of mine flipped so it's flesh side down. After I boiled them, I cut them all in half. So I like them all flesh side down so they get those little crispy edges, right? Who doesn't like a good crispy edge? My bonus boy loves my pancakes. Thanks, Leroy, because I always do my pancakes with a crispy edge. He's like, Mama Harmony, your pancakes are the best. Oof, I'm glad that your mom doesn't watch my show, Leroy. I just like them, again, all flesh side down. I just cut them in half. Get them little crispy edges. This is it, that's what we're doing. I'm gonna move this one over here. Why? Because I'm just kind of weird like that. I got some big ass purple potatoes here. Shout out to Melissa and her mom for introducing me to a purple potato. Love it, hello Sue. Okay, Sue is the one with the sunflowers. All right, guys, so we're just putting these potatoes in olive oil, salt, pepper, garlic, herb, roast stuff, and some fresh herbs. Remember, when you're using fresh herbs, that you're going to want to use more, okay? If you're using fresh herbs, you have to use more. It's much, much like, it's much more like not as flavorful when you use fresh herbs. So you have to use 
like two or three times the amount of fresh herbs. That's just the way it is. I apologize. It's not my fault. It's Mother Nature's fault. But when you dry herbs, it makes them more concentrated. So if you're using any kind of fresh herbs, just remember you got to use more. More, more, more. Yeah. That's, that's what I have. So I'm going to roast these in my 375 oven for, I don't know, 20-ish minutes, 10 minutes. I'm going to check them after 10 minutes just because I don't want them to get too crazy in there. Uh, but they should be good to go in at least 15 minutes. So it's a little bit of a process to do them these, this way, but I'll tell you. I was craving potatoes like mad crazy yesterday. I almost made myself fried potatoes, and I was like... Stop. Just stop. You have to have a Monday morsel. And I didn't have it on my videos. So that's why I'm rocking this as my Monday morsel. I swear I've done this before. I probably did just rosemary, but I'm rocking it out with this little blend tonight. Then I got it such a good deal. And I have to share. See? Got to share. Don't, don't knock it, you guys. You're going to know if it's bad. Okay. All right. In other news, I don't know if I have other news. I will see you all on Wednesday. This was a very short one. I will take pictures of these delicious potatoes when they come out. Um, I did have another round of BBK BBQ that went out, and I've gotten some pretty good reviews on that. Sounds like the fresh fruit needs to be a little more pureed, so I'm going to work on that. Other than that, um, I'm coming up with some new different flavors because now we're switching seasons a little bit, although you can't freaking tell outside. We are switching seasons a little bit. So this last time I did raspberry and blueberry chipotle as opposed to the cranberry chipotle. Uh, still stayed with the apple and ginger on the Carolina sauce and then the fig and habanero for the other red sauce. That one was really hot for me, I'm not going to lie, but I've heard it was not. Maybe it was just hot because I tasted it just when it was fresh. I don't know. But those are going to be ready very soon, I'm hoping. I still have to like get down to the nitty gritty and actually figure out how to can the sons of bitches. So there we are. There we have it. BBK BBQ is on its way though, you guys. If you are wanting to acquire any BBK gear, please let me know. I do have some t-shirts and some coffee mugs available. And other than that, I have not gotten with Miss Gale in order to get anything else done yet. But we will. We will get it done. Because that's how we roll around here in BBK. At our own damn pace. That's how we do it. Our own damn pace. All right, guys. I will see you all on Wednesday at 6. And I will take pictures of this as soon as it comes out. Thank you. Thank you very much for, en for joining me, enjoying me, okay, whichever. Enjoying my presence or joining me, whatever. Um, I will see you all on Wednesday at 6. Thanks so much for joining.